and welcome to the session on base systems. This is brought to you by Handaka Fanda. Suppose you are given a number in the decimal system. Decimal system is the system that we work in because it has 10 digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. If you want to convert it to some other base system x, all you got to do is to divide it by the number x repeatedly and have a look at the remainders. For example, if you are given the number 100 and you want to convert it to base 2, what you are going to do is, you are going to divide it by 2, you get 50, it's perfectly divisible, remainder is 0. Again divide, 25, remainder is 0. Again divide, again 12 and the remainder is 1. 2, 6, 0. 2, 3, 0. 2, it is divisible once and the remainder is 1. That means, if my number is 100 in the decimal system, and I want to convert it to binary, its conversion would be, I go from bottom to top, that is 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0 in the binary system. There are few other points to note here. The number which was given to me was 100 and it was divisible by the base 2 exactly twice, as you can see here. That means the last two digits will be 0. Suppose I convert 100 to base 7. Let's see what I get. 7, I get 14, the remainder is 2. I again divided by 7, it is divisible twice and the remainder is 0. So I get 202 in base 7. If I convert 100 to base 5, I'll first divide it by 5, I'll get 20, the remainder 0. I'll again divide it by 5, I'll get 4, the remainder 0. So the conversion would give me the value 400 in base 5. Couple of points to note once again. 100 is exactly divisible by 5 twice. That is why I have got two zeros. 100 is not divisible by 7. That is why I got 2 as the last. If I divide 100 by 7, 2 is my remainder. Not only that, as I am from 10, the base is going to 7 to 5. The value is increasing from 100. Then it is going to 400. That will always hold true. If I increase the base, the value goes down. If I decrease the base, the value goes up. Let us look at it the other way around. That means if I am given a particular value in base 5, let's say, and I want to convert it to decimal system, what am I going to do? The first point is in base 5, the digits that I can use are 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. Let's say my number is 341 in base 5. When I convert it to the decimal system, I need to note the digits into 5 to the power 0, into 5 to the power 1, and into 5 square. And I'll add all of them out. Why am I doing this? Because when I'm converting from decimal to base 5, I'm dividing. When I'll convert base 5 to base 10, I'll do the reverse process, which is multiplication. So this will become 25 into 3 or 75, 4 into 5 or 20, plus 1 into 1 or 1, that is 96, which tells me 345 in base 5 translates to, as you can see here as well, as my base has gone up, the value has decreased. The popular base systems are base 2, that is the binary system which gives us only 0 and 1, and the hexadecimal system which has 16 various representations. Now for the 16, what are we going to do? We can use the first 10 as 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. But what about the others? In that case, 10 is used, represented by A. 11 is represented by B. 12 is represented by C. 13 by D. 14 by E. And 15 with F. So suppose I am given a number which is let's say F22 in hexadecimal. What will be its value in the normal system? It will be F represents 15. I have 2 and 2. And then there will be increasing powers of 16. 16 to the power 0, 16 to the power 1 and 16 squared. Whatever this comes out as will be my answer in the decimal system. In binary, I can only use 1, 0, 0 and 1. For example, this is the number given to me in binary. It can very easily be converted. Because here, all I need to know, since it's either 1 or 0, 0 wills will be neglected. All I need to consider is, which powers of 2 will exist. 2 to the power 0 will be there, because it is 1 here. 
2 to the power 1 will be there because it is 1 here. 2 square will not. And this will be 2 q. So my answer will be effectively 8 plus 2 plus 1 or 11 in the decimal system. Please stay with us to continue the discussion on base systems. Thank you.